play. Going good, going good. And we're over here. And we're going to hit space. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for joining me on another Doodle Diary. Today we're doing Venom, made famous in the Spider-Man franchise. You know, always being being all up in Peter Parker's business. Of course, there's other spider Spider-Man. I think. I can't remember. I don't know. They've, they've done a lot. Basically, that's the good thing and the bad thing about comics is, is um, you know, you, you have a thousand different people telling the same story in their personal way, and that is beautiful. But, of course, it gets a bit confusing if you're somebody who's a diehard and wants to um, collect them all, so to speak, and get to enjoy all the the stories that are being told about your your favorite friendly neighborhood, Spider-Man. Of course, um, the movies, I think, pretty much destroyed me. And, um, you know, the way they did Venom, I, you know, I hate to, I don't want to gripe the whole thing, but let's just say it was a travesty. It hurt me deep inside. The casting, you know, nothing against that dude in the movie that they cast. Um, I can't remember. You know, the sad thing is I can only remember him as the, the, the wormy dude from the 70s show. And, uh, you know, cool beans. He's awesome dude. But I just, I, I don't know. It just hurt me. Um, <laughs> and I know. And I know. It didn't hurt me. It didn't, like, kill me. I didn't roll around on the floor wetting my pants, beating the earth. Um, but, you know, come on, man. You, know, you, you didn't, you didn't do me, you didn't do me, do me right there, Spider-Man. But anyway, um, hopefully they'll bring it back around and save us because apparently um at this juncture and in our entertainment industry it's a perpetual retelling of the same story over and over again which if you really think about it is how every story has been told around campfires told by different people like stories of heroic craziness and everybody tells the the same story in their own special way but um can we give it a few years please um, Hollywood, just a few years. I mean, I don't get me wrong. If we give it too many years, then I won't be able to enjoy it. Maybe you know. I mean, it could be to a point where you know you you, you don't want to wait too long. <laughs> Listen to me. I'm waffling here, back and forth, like wait a little, but don't wait too long, Hollywood. But you know, I I do enjoy it. They're really doing great things with them, um, the Avengers, and all. Um, I feel a bit overwhelmed when it comes to seeing that lineup. These 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 guys want to take our money for, for you know for a long period of time, um, which I've not been to the theater since I um, since the theater that I worked at closed down, which was fuck a, a while ago. It's I can't even remember. I don't know. I, I don't got the time to pull up the data. Um, this is a fast video, so let's get to business here. Um, as you can see here, um, Venom is black. He um he has um a black skin, but I didn't want to just walk in here with a with a black marker and just go to town because first off that would be a little crazy i would have to go at it at a different angle so i really went with layers of light blue to purple um really i kind of like they do in the comic books but of course i can give it my own little spin i just had fun with it i really enjoy working with color pencils i wish i had some better color pencils i have a few prismacolor um color pencils which really are and I, I don't like to back a brand, which I'm not sponsored. I wish um, I would tell you they were great because they really are. And I'll tell you now without being sponsored. Thanks, Prismacolor. Um, where's my care package? But um, they have some great. They 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 blend real well, and I really I really like that. But they're expensive. They're really expensive. And of course, when you draw and doodle like I do, you know it's you, you got to be careful. You got to be careful with you know your products. You don't want to just go waste them. Because you may not have the money to replenish your your supply, the markers especially. The markers, I'm trying to work with them and get a feel for them. I don't really work with markers. Even when I was younger, I didn't really work with markers. I used color pencils and crayons, and um, of course pastels and things. I don't have any pastels. I should get some oil pastel. We should work at oil pastel one day. I'm going to grab some of those up. I hope. I hope I can get those next time I get a little bit of folding money. I'll grab them up. But um, I hope that would be, you know. Something you'd look forward to. Tell me if you want to see me work with old pastels. It's like a glorified fancy crayon. crayon. But as you can see here, he's licking a little lollipop. I'm going in here with the black and the very dark purple. The dark purple. It looks kind of blue. The lighting I have here is better than last lighting. Because last time it was very yellowy. Yellowy and terrible. Um, so I apologize for that. I've, I've worked. I'm trying to get the better lighting. But, you know, all things 
do time. You'll see here it gets a little darker because um, I dropped down the the lighting a little bit. I, I dimmed it down a little bit because it was getting, I couldn't see the 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 real pop of the purple, which you can, when you, you know, maybe I'll take, a, when I got a good picture of it, this is for sale on my Etsy shop, so you can purchase it yourself if you want to. It's up there if you want to grab the original. Um, more than welcome. Thank you for helping support the channel and supporting me buying oil pastels and everything. <laughs> it takes, takes money to produce this. So, you know. Plus, you know, they got the team of editors and um, Suzanne, the PR department. Uh, great lady. Uh, of course, I'm lying about all of this. It's just me. <laughs> but um, as you can see here, um, we're doodling it up real good. I'm, I'm going to push it a little bit further here. Um, as I'm talking, I'm watching the rest of this, the video. And I, you know, it literally is could be any length I want it because I've adjusted it. And I don't want it to be too fast. But I want it to be fast enough where you can, you, you don't get bored. But, you know, listening to, um, you know, the, the, the feedback, I'm going to put some fast-paced just run-throughs. Um, where it's just really like a short video. You can just enjoy looking at the art with a little bit of music. And of course, other times I'm going to do vlogs like this, which is going to be great. Um, recently, I, I there's a little um, bank um, credit union that I have, and they run a little contest of taking a picture in front of the place and posting it online. And no one was doing it, so I did it. And of course, through the outpour of my Twitter, if you're not following me on Twitter, I don't know, what you're doing here i put so many nude pictures up i mean literally me and you know little furry under underpants like stalking around the woods like a caveman it's beautiful you should go there i don't know why you're not it's amazing um it's art so go there and check out my twitter um if you're going there for the sole purpose of seeing me naked then shame on you um shame on you you should be going there because you want to help me and and look at things. I don't really talk about much on Twitter, so you're safe with following me. But on Twitter, I um, all the people who helped with the um, thumbsing up and giving me the five stars helped me to win it. Uh, Monday we'll know for sure, but there is no sh there is not a shadow of a doubt that I have not won because we blasted the competition with the help from all the people on Twitter. Thank you so very much if you're one who voted. I love you. If you were here right now, I don't care if you hadn't washed in three weeks. I would still have maybe three, okay, maybe in three days. Three weeks, you'd be really smelly. Maybe you'd get to a point of smelly that you wouldn't be smelly anymore. Like you transcend stench into another realm that actually smells good, like you come back around on the other side of the spectrum. I don't know. We'll try that out. Um, somebody don't wash for three weeks, see me at a convention or something, and then hug me. And then I will tell you. Um, in the nicest way possible, you know, I'm not going to go P.U. and like pinch my nose like some kind of weird shit. I'll be like, yeah, you, you have a ripe aroma or something like that. But anyway, I would still hug you nevertheless because you helped me, and I do appreciate that. That money, of course, if you've been watching the streams, you've been hearing me gripe and complain about Grand Theft Auto being released. I love it so dearly. Everyone should go pick it up. It's a great game, but it's very taxing on your computer. And old Betty here, I just named her Betty. She's she's sexy, and she's old, much like Betty White. Which, if you just if you put two and two together, there, I just called Betty White sexy. But hey, she was a looker back in the day. The Golden Girls, she was not so much a looker. But hey, you see all pictures of Betty White. Google it. Go Google a picture of Betty White. She's a gorgeous lady. You know, age. We're all gonna get wrinkles, so don't bust my chops here, everybody. But Betty, my computer. Not, not the Golden Girls actress, Betty White. Um, yeah, yeah. Um, she's getting a little age on her, and I'm going to have to get another processor and a bit of more RAM because I was strapped for cash when I built her and only put 8 gigs, and I got room for 16. So, you know, hey, if there's room, cram it in, right? You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, that would work for a bunch of things, but I don't know. Don't, don't come at me with your complaints. Don't just cram things with stuff just because there's room. Don't do that. It's bad I have to tell you that because some of you are going to try to cram things and stuff. I don't know what, but anyway, off the topic. It's shit. Anyway, I'm, I'm going to have to spend all majority of the 500 It was a $500 um, reward for winning the contest or award, a prize. That's the word. Sorry. Um, we're working my way through this. Um, um, $500 to help me 
to upgrade my computer. And the rest, of course, is going to paying bills and such. Uh, yeah, I'm going to be using Adobe Illustrator more on stream, hopefully, because once I upgrade my computer, I'm going to start the 30-day free trial. So if you want some art, buy some art. Buy a puppet. Tell someone. I know, Pat, but Patrick, I'm super poor, and I don't have any money. I would have to resort to hooking and selling math. Don't hook and sell math, of course. It, that's terrible. It's a bad idea. I've had to do it. It's terrible. Oh, it's terrible. But doing them at the same time, you got double the pain. So just cut, out, cut that out. Do something better. But um, tell someone if you can't. Um, tell, you know, you're the hooker that you know or a meth dealer. Tell someone about the art. You know, they, they surely should have money. I mean, the drug industry is ridiculous. That's why people do it. They shouldn't do it, though. It's terrible. Um, you know, not, you know, not drugs as in marijuana. I mean, drugs as in meth and stuff, you know, like sniffing paint and, and, you know, licking toads and stuff like that. That weird shit that no one should ever do. But somehow they do, and I don't know why they do it. Uh, we think we're invincible humans, don't we? But really, the thing is, we're just, we're just a blip. Just a tiny drip of paint on a canvas that is ginormous. That's a word. Look it up. Anyway, we, we've talked far too long. If you're watching through all of this, I love you. Please hit the thumbs up button. It's important to me. I, I completely, my self-worth is based on exactly you thumbsing up and you commenting. If you don't, just think about it. You're just spitting in my face. You may as well just spit in my face. Thanks. You're spitting in my face if you don't comment. Oh, God, it hurts. I'm just, just terrible. I'm, I'm feeling terrible inside. Boost my <laughs> self-esteem with a, a thumbs up and a comment. Tell me how much you love these, because I really enjoy producing them. It's just, um, you know, i got to upgrade this computer and got to sell some art. So I'm going to take a sip of coffee now, which is rude as shit, but I'm going to do it. Oh, yeah. It's terrible coffee, too. Hey, but hey, you got to do what you got to do. <laughs> I love, I would really do love these. I love, I love knowing that I'm talking to, I don't know, however many is listening. So if you enjoy this, please let me know. I know a lot of you said you did via um, Twitch and um, the live streams and, of course, with the comments on the Gengar video. And the Gengar video is posted up here. I'd like to thank the patrons um, for sticking with me as I'm fumbling my way through my personal art. And, of course, the Twitch, the live streams and everything. You don't know how much you're helping that little bit right now is paying a bill every month, going directly to the cable, which is the, the internet. That's all I have, so just the internet. I don't get to watch Game of Thrones, ladies and gents. I mean, I do, but, you know, I find a way. Everyone, I, I thank you for joining, um, and I thank you for listening to my rambles. If you got something out of it, tell me. If you want to see me draw something in the future, tell me. If you want to help me on Patreon and links and donations and things like that, all those are below. And buy some art, all of them, in the description. I love you. I can't wait to talk to you again. And take care for now. I almost did a kissy noise. I kind of feel like I need to now. I'm going to do it. Prepare yourself. Okay, I'm gone now. Bye.